everyone, we're back. I don't know why I said everyone, but I just say we're back. Yeah, subscribe, do that stuff, like the video. <laughs> yeah, last time, uh, we met Rio, who's the guy who found toxic waste. We met our childhood friend who likes to play in mud because that's evil. And we we met uh, w Willow, who has invisible glasses. And we, we, and we found out about the legend of the bench. Yes. <laughs> so yeah, let's continue on. Okay, this is fine. This is going to go great. I'm confident. We I've talked to girls before. But it's no different, right? <laughs> She's not a girl. It's me, Dio. Also, I realize the other background is like the same one as like the other game. I forget which one. It took you too long enough. <laughs> yeah, Tonkai was standing outside looking lost. <laughs> I didn't know where the cafe was. It was in front of you. I sort of know what the cafe was. I feel like myself starting to blush. Yeah, I've never been here before. Wasn't sure which building it was. Tim recalled me a few days ago. I can't agree at the table. He jumped and grabs his leg. Never mind, but I've been some other place. Yeah, it was the other cafe. Oh. You want to hear me the one on the other side of town? Which is basically <laughs> different. Probably gives me an encouraging look. Man, I'm bombing today. I didn't know where the cafe was. It could have been on this side of the town or the other one. So, Willow, how's our studying going? Not gonna lie, I'm a little stressed. My parents put a lot of pressure on me. Thud! Papa kicks me under the table and motions towards Willow. That's our chance, I guess. God, we're just like cooking each other. God. Yeah, mine do too. You know how stressful it is to feel like your worth is in the grade, you know? Yeah, I'm worth more than that. I'm a good daughter. <laughs> well, I don't know. You just say that loud. I'm a good daughter. I mean, I don't do <laughs> Don't do drugs, kids. I don't drink. <laughs> I don't have S. She got herself off. Oh, I'm blushing with her. Laugh. Oh, I get it. Oh, I don't get it. <laughs> If it makes you feel any better, Togai doesn't <laughs> either. I can't help but laugh. I can feel my shoulders slump and a little more relax. Does she mean she can't shoulder slump anymore? <laughs> what do you want to do once you're graduated? I wanna go to, I wanna go to university for archaeology. I cannot speak big words, big science words especially. Do you want me an adventurer? Okay, that's definitely what it is. <laughs> Not exactly. Isn't that what archaeologists do? Where a fedora carry around a whip fight Nazis? <laughs> of course! <laughs> of course they fight Nazis. <laughs> Thanks, you, Rio. I still don't know how to say your name. The only one I know who does. <laughs> Wait. Who, they're supposed to be referencing someone, but I don't know pop culture is all that good. So, yeah. So, if you know wh what they're talking about, Comment down below, I guess. What is looking around, looking at me like I have three heads? Indiana Jones? <laughs> oh, shakes her head. Who's <laughs> Wait a minute. You know who, you know, like, some random guy with, who fights Nazis, but you don't know Indiana Jones? One of the greatest ecologists of all time. Well, until you become one. I've never been heard of him. You don't, you don't watch a lot of movies, do you? Hey, that's okay. We can fix that. <laughs> we start with the archaeology movies, which will only take us about an hour or two. All of them? Are we just watching them? Like all every single archaeology like uh, movie there is, like at once. So here's this one going on. Here's this one going on. Oh God! Why is Willow making this creepy face? Willow isn't evil. She just has a weird demeanor. Me and my Willow, on the other hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen the radio th radiate through the room. I can feel my heart just skip a beat as she leans closer to me. She has a glint in her eye. Does Indiana Jones have a sidekick? What does that matter? What? Why do I feel like this is going to like, bite me in the butt later on? Like, oh, you can become my scientist and my dungeon. <laughs> did I say, wait, wait, what did I say? Did I say sidekick? No, but maybe he just couldn't find the right one. I thought he did have a sidekick or something. Or he just kept replacing him, I think. Yeah. <laughs> I wish just to brush a hair of her eye. 
The water splashes across the table and onto her skirt. How do you know that? Uh, aren't we on, like, well, maybe she's, like, to the side of him. Maybe not so, or someone. But still, I'm pretty sure you don't see, like, the whole thing. Oh, man. I didn't mean to. Here, wrap this around your waist to cover the stain. And went on my jacket. Ha, <laughs> I did bring the jacket. No, no, you don't need this. Oh, yeah, talking about how I would bring my jacket I forgot about from last time. It'll warm out. I won't freeze, don't worry. Let me get a cloth to clean this up. I'll grab one. As I stand up, I like to get on the table over. Then the flame goes on. Oh, crap. Then the... Then Rio turns on fire. Oh god, what do I do? For out with the napkin. Yeah, boy. <laughs> be careful, don't guy. I stop the flames with no towel. I thought I had a napkin. I think you're just making me angry. Time to find this final boss. Fire on a, in a napkin. Yes. Rio joins with, with another napkin. If we have two napkins, they're better than one. Yes. If we can deprive it of oxygen, then we can. Sorry, can't you say that as a CD certain level for me? Just slap it. We will probably both join in. Four napkins against one fire. Man, this is the ultimate dream team here. The fire, the fire sizzles to a stop. God. Why is it without some entertainment, right? Isn't there other people in the same room, though? <laughs> we don't probably burst, burst into laughter. That way it points to the door. <laughs> hey, that was pretty fun, right? Oh man, I can't believe they kicked us out. It's not like we were throwing a fire or anything. <laughs> man, I know if anything, we made it, that place better. Right, I totally lit owned. Boom, 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 boom. Collecting groans from everyone but Rio. <laughs> While we playfully shows Rio. I don't know how you made a flood and arson sound lame. We managed to Rio. Gosh. What's this anything the whole day I've been on? Can't help but smirk at the word date. We didn't even make it to the appetizers. Well, why don't we just all skip to dessert? <laughs> Thank God the date's not over yet. This place is a lot more laid back. I feel more, way more comfortable. This time we can make a bigger fire with eight napkins. Will turns over the menu in front of me. Can decide what to get. She just turned it over. <laughs> like, oh, like she picks up a book. Oh, are you, are, are you having trouble with that book? Mm -hmm. Starts playing a game. Oh, uh, are you having trouble with that game? Mm -hmm. I can never get ice cream. Tragic. Then that's a tragedy. Have you ever heard the tragedy of Willow, the Blue? I <laughs> mean, Willow, the Invisible Glasses. It's a story that Toge wouldn't tell. <laughs> she would order ice cream, but she would fro order frozen yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> what should I say? It's better for you, ice cream. Frozen yogurt is an imposter. Frozen yogurt is an imposter. That's how you're an imposter. It's just fake. It's all fake. It's like ice cream with all the fun soaked out of it. Ugh. Technically, it's just ice cream without the cream. Is that really it? <laughs> We're just like, I'm gonna cry about this. Oh, uh, no. My whole world. This this is what yogurt was. Just stuff without the cream. Oh, well, yeah. We just banned a gun against the delicious dessert imposter. Ice cream or nothing. Rocky Road or strawberry. Strawberry. <laughs> we'll sleep up through the counter. I have a small rocky roll, please. <laughs> she cast me a smick over her shoulder. What can I say? We have different tastes. <laughs> to be honest, I don't like strawberry, so... <laughs> I guess that's something I can I can like about you. We found desserts down to a few, final few bites. We all lay, lay back in our chairs. Does that make up for a dinner? I think, I think so. I just got the voice mixed up again. Er, not quite. I'm so, uh, being traumatic about how yogurt is just like ice cream without cream. I laugh and laugh to check it at Rio's head. We completely misses. And slides so against Widow's face. <laughs> I was gonna say it was gonna hit one of the girls' face. Wait, it. 
what is going on? Like, how bad was our aim? Because I don't think, like, Willow's behind him or something. Like, how does that work? It's like, I don't know, like, we, like, somehow, like, threw it at, like, a 90-degree angle or something. I'm so sorry. Come on, wife, to tear off her face. Screw this up again. No, we're sorry. I'm the one who's sorry. <laughs> yeah, your face is a magnet to cherries, apparently. Splat. Cherry land launches from my face. No giggles, giggle instantly and makes me laugh. She looks evil in that laughing face. Hey, let me out of this. You didn't get hit, man. This is your war. He lashes, bites, bits of tongues at my face. We go voice and giggles. Finally locks her gaze on Willow. I never seen you laugh like this. I don't really have time to do. She lo looks lost for a moment. And she tries to find the words. Distant. <laughs> There's a desperate tongue inside me. I just want to hope her. To have fun, I guess. I use my empty container. Cheers. To, to more fun than, than them. <laughs> oh, better home. Head home now. Yeah, I do the same. I have some homework to do. It's the only night without any work to do. I really have, like to have a little more fun. What about you, tall guy? What should I do? <laughs> Free me own choice. Too bad. Go for go home for the night. Oh, I think I'll head home for the night too. Oh, I'll walk that way with you. Yes, Rio. <laughs> we'll call a ride. See you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Well, that sounded rude. How do you think it went? I think you said ten o'clock on fire and got sucked out. <laughs> but you made her laugh. So it's hard to say. See that her and Pommy are friends. That's so different. I can't tell if she likes me. You can always ask Quampy. I don't know a girl. I don't know if a girl code would allow it. You should ask her what she feels about me while we're at, we're at it. That's something I can definitely do. <laughs> I can't stop thinking about that date. <clears throat> Willow's different from everyone I know. She's so mature. Thud. What, what the heck was that? Let me in your dork. What? Poppy hovers outside the window, shivering. You know where I live? What is she doing here? Oh god, I'm in my boxers. I'm about to brawl her up. Poppy, what are you? I feel my cheeks. <laughs> Red high as I yank a blanket over myself. She has entered the room, looted at, at the warm air. Left your phone at the ice cream place. Nice to see you still in your childhood house. Oh. Apparently we never moved. Where's she had to be looking at everything? Although there are a lot of fewer dinosaurs in here than I remember. But the props on my bed relax. Well, she's way too comfortable for me. So tonight was a blast, huh? What did Willow say? I can't tell you that. Girl code. <laughs> Dang. Girl code. Man, our our brain is like the most like uh, edgy one here. Not me, not Poppy, not Rio, not Willow. My brain is like like literally the only one who swore is my brain. Like what the heck? What I can't tell you is that you should go out with her again. So sure, she liked me. Poppy winks and shrugs. I don't know. Her playful grin seems to lamp the dinosaur less <laughs> room. Dinosaur less. My dinosaur. When I left my room, the parents took away my dinosaurs. Where are they? Are they gone? Are they safe? But I do know a lot of guys are interested in her. Older guys. <laughs> smart guys. Are you saying I'm not smart? <laughs> me, no, I would never. She elbows me playfully. Sit down next to her on the bed. My silence flies upon us. What do I say? So how did I, so how did it go with Rio? Yeah, how did it go with Rio? Rio. I don't know how his name goes. It was fine. Not good, huh? No, he's great. Really handsome. <laughs> I feel a tinge of disappointment. She thinks he's handsome. That shouldn't bother me. Yeah, he's a nice guy. You don't. You don't think I shouldn't pursue him? Where's she getting that from? I never said that. Rio's a great guy. I guess you're not, you're just not wingmanning <laughs> as much as I thought you'd be. I guess you have a right to see for yourself if you like him. Well, that's me. Without me telling you he's saved a cat from a burning building. Or can bench 300 pounds or something like that. I don't think I hear appreciate that, appreciate that, but I do. Got her at home, but you should, next, you should text her. Ask her out again. 
Yeah, I'll get her number tomorrow. I'm going to say, like, do I have her, like, number? Check your contacts. Of course, I'll be in on it. I said I'd be a good partner in crime, didn't I? Thank you, Poppy. I'll see you tomorrow. No, 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 no. I really hope I see Willow today. I should text her. But what should I say? You look like you won't you be back in bed. I'm trying to decide what to text Willow. Oh, the big first text. Emojis or no emojis? Hmm, exclamation marks or none? Hi or hey? <laughs> I like you. Like you, let's get married. You're making me more nervous. Just be yourself. I text a happy last night. What did you say? I sent her a gif of a bunny to talk about. <laughs> Amazing. Flashes the phone at me. God, he actually did. And he's an anime girl instead. What did she say? Well, nothing yet. <laughs> Little did he know, Poppy doesn't have a, a phone. <laughs> what is she supposed to say back to that? Oh no, so the boy drift back. She probably just fell asleep right after a date. I mean, that was him. God. Yeah, she totally didn't come to my house. Well, I'm not sweating it. I'm sure I'll see her today. Speaking of what's that, have you seen Willow at all? Not yet. Don't you have a class with her today? Yeah. Try to sit next to her. Plan another date. The secretary waits for the secretary waits for no one. Am I right? This is almost over, and Will is nowhere to be seen. I can't believe she hasn't shown up. I'm waiting class next to her empty desk. But may have started to pass, and she's nowhere to be seen. Is she okay? She's, she's such a good student. What if she missed class? What should I, what should I text her? What if I should ask her if she's okay? Apparently, footsteps echo from down the hall. Don't worry, I'm not going to use emojis. Please stop being uh, scary. But I don't bother to look up for my phone. Thud! Who just ran into me? Hey! Oh yeah, the third girl. <laughs> I forgot. Uh, usually they have three girls in the thing. Uh, I don't really have a voice, though. Uh, ooh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The girl falls to the ground, scrambling to pick up her bag's contents. Bird seat, a net, a rope. Where is she planning? <laughs> Do we need a thumbnail? She looks too close to the thumbnail, but whatever. I guess we need it for something. Right. <laughs> but yeah, why is she ha her hand out? Who the heck is this girl? I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm in an hour. She has me my phone. The screen is cracked. Black. Oh no. No, no. I didn't mean to run into you. This is just a situation and I have to take care of it. Wait. Was she crying? My parents always say I'll never watch where I'm going. I guess you're it. After all. She just pulling out her collar, swaying, teared up, teary eyed. Is it hot in here? Am I talking a lot? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. just. The strange girl looks nervously into her classroom down the hall. What should I say? You broke my phone! You broke my phone! She gasped, the tears glistening in her eyes. You broke my phone! Now you must pay with your life! Oh, great. I may a cute girl actually cry. I'm so sorry. I'm sure we can salvage it. She was a few exposed wires around. What? Wait, she, she... I thought she cracked it. I didn't think she broke it open. You don't have to. The phone sparks. Fix it? It's okay. I was just in the middle of... In the middle of... Texting someone. Here. Texting for my phone. No, that's okay. No, really. Who is it? No one. Don't worry about it. Are you... Are you crying? She grab, she drags her sleeve across her watering eyes. No, <laughs> yes, it's not because of your phone. She glances nervously over her shoulder. Is someone after you? The image is going to be, will be if they find out what I'm doing. And banging from the classroom lawn to her to their feet. I gotta go. Concern is painted all over her face. She went around in the corner into the classroom. I never met someone like that before. Before. What on earth is she doing? Selling a scream from the classroom. It sounds like that girl I ran into. Loud thuds and bangs. I walk towards the door as she screams. Continues. Is she okay? What the heck is going on? Like I said, the brain is like the only one that's swearing. Around the corner of the classroom and stop in the middle court doorway. Nothing can prepare me for what was inside. <laughs> Anime woman. <laughs> and yeah, that was the episode. What happened? Well, we had our date, or a double date, I mean. 
Uh, Rio is. He did not want to be in a war. Uh, of course, he didn't. The chicken. <laughs> the man who can bench press 300 pounds can take down. Uh, I mean, save a cat from a burning building and do all that stuff. So, yeah. With that being said, subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. A bird thrashing against the wall of the classroom. Desperate to escape. <laughs> what?